Hey everyone, welcome back to Shiny Bright Doggo. Before we head into the video, um, today is Janine's birthday. So if you're watching this on Friday the 5th, it is Janine's birthday. And I thought before we go into thrifting, and if you want to skip ahead to thrifting, here's a little timestamp of when that starts. But before that, um, we're going to go and get some party supplies and surprise Janine when she wakes up. It's about 7.30, 8 o'clock right now. Um, so I thought I'd go out and get some things, and I'll show you what I got her. Um, and then... I'll be able to put in the video like the little setup of like you know surprising her for her birthday um but you'll see the gift is potentially an activity that we might do today so I won't be able to film that and put it in this video but anyway let me show you the card to start so this is the card I got her like months ago and it's perfect I mean it does say sun but we can ignore that um it's a Casper birthday card and then Janine has always loved bonsai trees and she's wanted one for years so I'm going to surprise her and get her a bonsai tree. I found like a um, local, well, somewhat local bonsai place. So the plan is to give her that card with the bonsai bucks inside. And if she wants to go today, we can go today. If she wants to go another time and do something else today, we could do that. Um, but that's what I got her for her birthday. We've been together for a while. So, um, you know, you got to get creative. And I love doing stuff like this. She's not like a huge surprise person, but um, I like to surprise her. So I'm going to do it anyway. Um, but let's go over to Walmart and get some party supplies and then decorate a little space inside for when she wakes up. Now that I'm looking at this stuff at Walmart, I'm thinking I should have thrifted something. <laughs> I did not really plan. We've been so busy, but I sort of love these little... We're having cake later, just the two of us. She wanted a cannoli cake, so maybe I'll get little dishes. Um, and maybe like a little banner that says happy birthday. So I decided on this little polka dot moment happening here. And I'm really tempted to get this. I might have to. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get it. Look at this little pinata. Little shark plates. That's cute too. But I think I'm gonna stick to the original plan. Okay, something to know about Janine and I, especially Janine, is that we really like blind boxes. <laughs> um, so I'm thinking I'm getting her maybe a few to put with the card. Um, she wanted one from Five Below, but they don't open till 10. So I'm gonna work with what we have here. Like, look at this Polly Pocket now. Polly Pocket Pajama Party. I wonder what's, is it a little, oh my gosh, it's like back in the day. Maybe I'll get her one of these. I want one though. All right, we can get through the cat or the sheep it looks like. Which one would she like? Oh, the little moon. I think I'm gonna go with the sheep. Even though she likes cats. Cute. Okay, I'll get that. I also found this Jurassic World, like, um, dinosaur something, <laughs> which is right up her alley, so I gotta get her this too. I'll look for a few more, but I think I have to head back before she gets up. Guys, I got distracted. I found the Halloween stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I guess this is more fall. Yes, yeah, definitely more fall, but there is a little ghosty pillow. Oh, he's so cheap. It's crazy. Um... Like, I'm obsessed, but I really got a refrain. Okay. All right, let's, let's go to the register before before more stuff ends up in the cart. Okay, I blew one letter up. These are so much bigger than I thought. Here's a credenza. And who would have thought that a tablecloth does not really fit a credenza, but that's neither here nor there. This is the space I'm trying to put it in. These things are huge. All right, we'll see. So I grossly underestimated the size of these things and had to improvise, but I think it came out okay. And then I have this little setup, the credenza with the tablecloth. Uh, had to do some finagling, but put some pumpkins, some friends, her card in the blind boxes. This is the setup. She's going to open it soon. If I can capture anything in time for the video, I will. But otherwise, we'll give you a recap in the next video of how it went. Um, and we'll head into thrifting. Janine's about to open up her gift. She woke up. Happy birthday, Janine. Thank you. And thank you, everyone, who said um, happy birthday over the past, like, week and everything and today. So thank you so much. Happy birthday, Janine. Thank you. Look. Oh, Look, Janine. She's like a little she's one. Oh, she's so cute. We got to get her. Does she light up? She might light up, too. And I have to get a card. Um, and this 
This one's new and out. The purple one's rarer, harder to find. Ooh. Made in excuse China. me, excuse me, get out of the way. I want to look. I want to look over here. Excuse me, do that one. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's she's cute. No, 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 no. You should get the. You should get the. You should get it first. No, but I need to look. Sure, I'll be right here. Looking. Okay. Well, I'm gonna look. All right, all right. I'll go. Wait, what's that on the other side? Okay, I'll go get a card. That's cool. The plate? Yeah. All right, I'll go get a cart. Find anything while I went to get a cart? I found this cute little Jemmy animatronic. That's fun. It's kind of cute. Six dollars? Um, six. And it looks like there's battery corrosion. So I don't know if he'd work. You should look it up on eBay though, because yeah, they like surprisingly will. can do very well. Fun find though. Did you see Tigger? No. Tigger's right here. He's four dollars. A little vampire I'm trying to find a year he's cute i like him he's got these little like opposable arms and legs he's cute i'm gonna look him up too but i like him what'd you find i found a really cute piggy bank and i wish it was bigger because this would be the piggy bank it looks like the um yes um, the st patrick's day mm -hmm. one we found Ninety nine. Wow, well, pricey. Kind of expensive. She's really pretty though. She might be a Lufton. She's pretty. She's but, cute. Uh, Four ninety nine. She's too know. tiny. Look what we found in the toy aisle. Fifteen. Twenty five percent off. Spirit Halloween. Sticky. It's sticky and it's from Is there Spirit Halloween. Year? No. Hmm. I wonder what year it's from. It's pretty cool though. It's pretty big. Although it's not really giving me Frankenstein vibes. It's giving me like. It's I don't know. Like I mean, it's like obviously Frankenstein. I just mean that it's like, I don't know. I'm not digging it. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I mean, it's, it's cool, but I just feel like Frankenstein doesn't normally have his mouth like this. It's like zombie. Yeah, it's like zombie Frankenstein. Look at this guy, Janine. Cash Patch Kids Kusos. It's like an animal. Oh, yeah. Those are those ones. It's, it's like a naked mole rat. Yeah. It's ten dollars. I'm gonna put it here. It's also pink, so no percent off. I think they are worth the money. I'll look it up. It's probably why it's ten dollars. Oh my god, look! This is a newer one, right? It looks like it to me. Yeah, I want one of the older ones, but look, it's got the little babies in there. <laughs> huh. Well, sorry. Hmm. Who? Oh, the pumpkin? He sort of matches the cat that was over here. They match. Sort of. Yeah. They're cute. Look at this, Janine. This is, um, strawberry shortcake. Is it older? <gasps> it looks it, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. $2.99? All the way from over here, it does. Yeah, from it. Yeah. I think these are... Unless they like rebooted them, let's see if we can get a date. They might be newer, but the clothes look older. I'm gonna do a little bit of investigating and see if I can get a date on this or on these. They might be newer, actually. The more I look, all right, we'll see. We'll see. I'm finding in sync bears. So we've got Joey, got Justin. How many more do we need? Three, two. There's five in the group. Right? Yeah, we need three more. <laughs> Um, I don't think they're here. I'll double check though. Like this. Little bears. So after some careful finagling on um, these dolls in the back of their backs is um, a made in Hong Kong stamp. So these are from the 70s. These are old strawberry shortcake, which is really exciting. And I might pick them up. Or 80s. Or 80s, true. Good point. Um, but they definitely look older. Is she Ellen? Late 70s, she I think. Was? Maybe early. I don't. I'm not entirely sure. Don't call me. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Um, I'll look up some comps just to see, but it's only three dollars. They definitely missed this. They didn't know what it was for sure. Because if they did, they definitely would have marked these up. So that is exciting. Janine, um, do show, do show. She some more. Three, I think, are in here. Plus a troll. 
Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled. Yeah. Add Can I add them to the cart? Yeah. yeah, yeah um, in sync bears, there were three of these guys. They're from the year 2000, so authentic for sure. Um, three of these sold for $30, so I might think about picking up these two. Maybe just Justin. We'll see. Jeez, I have that one. Pornos. I'm so jealous. Oh, how much are they? Oh, they're $6. Oh, I might get them. <laughs> That's okie dokie. I had the okie dokie bags when they first came out by the sports sack in the mid 2000s. Um, love that. Anything else? Uh, not yet. Not yet. Okay. Keep looking. You guys got to stick around and see what was in these bags. Very exciting. I'm gonna get the uh, which we have the giant version at home, but this one lights up, I think. And I found these baby bottles, and I had a hunch they're from like our childhood, early 90s. Mm -hmm. I had a hunch that they could potentially resell, and I looked them up on eBay, and they have a pretty good resale value. They're in really good condition, too. They are. Yeah. I imagine people maybe still, I don't know if parents still use these type of mm -hmm. bottles, or if people are buying it more for the nostalgia. They're $1.50 each. I'll probably do a big lot on eBay start them low and see if um forbidding but there are a ton of bottles over there but these were the really really cute ones that are vintage believe it or not crazy i really like this little um baby dinosaur one yeah and from 1994 cute. animals in the colors are so cute very cute so i think i think that's about it i think we're gonna set up one other thrift store maybe guys they have restocked at the second location um for sure this shelves are stocked um i'm immediately looking for any blow molds i don't see any but there are a lot of little pails this one's really cute i don't know what's going on with his handle oh look at these so different these are like oh metallic -y, like um yeah. iridescent look at these i had them for eight dollars though cookie cutters wow that's fun um, can you believe how packed the shelf is? Those are cute. The shelves are really packed. They restocked, don't you think? They, they Janine, where were the funny glasses when we needed them? <laughs> what did you say they knew that we were coming? Yeah, they, they might have. They might have known. Oh! Oh, Janine, you found your first really good find of the Halloween season. Yes. <laughs> this is from the 90s. It is a little um, pumpkin candle candelabra. And it goes for like 15 ish dollars, give or take. It's a really good find. We like to find these. Mm -hmm. It's got some discoloration going on there, but that's a good find, Janine. Nice. The little tykes. Oh, little tykes. Six dollars? That's not a bad price. I don't nice. Know if it works, though. Isn't that supposed to, like, Something's supposed to happen. Oh, wait, I guess it did. Well, it opens. Or it's supposed to open. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, wow, a lot of good pails here. When you're looking out for pails. Ooh, this one's um, Carolina, and it's riveted with a thick Ooh. plastic handle. It's only 99 cents. This is like a true like 80s, 90s pail when you're looking out for pails. Um, these are like the last of their kind that are made with a thick plastic. You'll see these are newer. They're just, they bend right in typically. Their handles are really cool. thin compared to this. What? Wow, that is cool. That's cool, no? I love that. Yeah, that's really cool. Um, is there a date on it? 1993, Janine. Wow. It's got those illustrations. I mean, that's awesome. Cool. So, yeah, it's got some light covers. They're sort of faded. They're all different. Three dollars. It's not a bad price, though. Hmm. What? 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 I know. I saw that one. Isn't it cool? But I said I don't know what's going on with the handle, though. Uh, I think it's a new handle. Like they but that face it? is like different, no? Yeah. Why is it like that? It's different. What is it? Yeah, but I don't know. Uh, no I think it's just that the spray paint is a little bit misaligned with the mold. We are just wild. 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 We got excited. I mean, can you blame us? Look at all the Halloween. These are fun. Janine. These like neon. Yeah. Plasticky bags. Here's this. Here you go. What's that? 
cute. This little guy is cute. Oh, look, it's a Beanie Babies. I don't know what this guy is. This is like a newer one. Beanie Baby? Huh? This is a newer one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Beanie Babies? This is newer, not a true blue mold, but still cool. This little plate? Yeah. It's only a dollar. It's a good price. What about here? Spooky gloves. Nice. Oh no, holding a Halloween Snoopy oh no. pencils. <laughs> it's good old chalk. It's chalk. Your man, your man. This? Yeah, isn't that cool? Yeah, that's cool. What is it called? Gross out? Gross out monsters? Gross doodle monsters? Something like that? Interesting. Also, I'm seeing like everything in my eyes are like, look at these. <laughs> oh, those are cute. That's a good price. $5? They're definitely older. Huh. Fun. Home Depot game? Oh my god, Home Depot game. <laughs> Is it really a Home Depot game? It's like a, no, it's like a kid, I guess. Oh, he's cute. Mm -hmm. A little um, candy corn cap. Mm -hmm. Sugar loaf, this came out of a claw machine. Yeah. Cute. Look, Janine. Oh, wow. That's a newer one, though. Five dollars, though. Um, Is it a newer one? That's cool. Wow. A little old mobile. Yeah. Um, they cut off the tag. Um, no, I can't that's tell. older to me, but he's cute. He is. I like him. How much is he? Five dollars. Orange, so two fifty. Look at this whole bag of Polly Pocket clothes, Janine. Oh wow! Oh my God, I have so many, so many, like the whole, every single one you could ever imagine. Like I had them all. Well, there's one in there. Oh, this bell. I had that dress. I had Maybe this dress. Like the Disney Maybe. I had this. I had that. It's crazy how like once you see things, you can just like remember whether or not you had them, you know? Yeah. But if you ask me which ones I had as a kid, I couldn't tell you. I had that one with the little starburst. $8. I wonder if that's a good price. Hmm. Interesting. Janine found an old vintage um, Lucy, right? Mm -hmm. For $10. How cute is she? Look at her little face. Love her. Mm -hmm. I also found this Jemmy. Uh, so it's called a spirit ball with like this Frankenstein looking dude. Um, and he can resell for like $30 to $50 possibly. There's two different versions that they made. One that's a little bit more uh, detailed that sells for like $100. This is $10. I'm probably not going to get it just because I don't... You know, we're not full-time resellers, so gotta pick and choose. I'm not super interested in this one, but really cool and something to look out for. Janine, what do you got there? I got myself a... There's one even more. General Foam. General Foam? Turn around and show it. Yeah, it's the same face as... It doesn't, it doesn't say General Foam. You know, we were thinking of doing like a pumpkin identification crash course mm -hmm. on YouTube, like doing a video all about pumpkin pails. If you guys are interested in that, leave a comment and let us know. But this is a really fun pink pail, which is harder to find for sure. Harder to find. Have to get this pink one. No pumpkin left behind. The pumpkin season has begun. That was a pretty good uh, thrift trip, Janine, right? Yeah, we went to a few thrift stores and now we're going to show you what we got. We had a great day at the thrift store. We got some good things. We found a lot. We saw a lot. Um, and I picked up this Gofa, I believe it is. Mm -hmm. G-O-F-F-A, which, which if you watch our videos and you were watching last year, should look pretty familiar. Mm -hmm. She's a smaller one and she does, I notice, have this little plastic bit and it looks like she might have flashing eyes. So I put some batteries in her wow. and her eyes light up. I don't know if this is a sensor thing. Janine and I were trying to test it and we couldn't really figure it out, but she is so fun and I love her. She was $6, which is, I think, a score. I picked up these baby bottles as you guys saw in the video. 
um, they have a great resale value. I'll put in some comps here. It's quite crazy to me um, that there were nine at the thrift store in all these different uh, patterns. I love the little dinosaurs. And these are currently on my eBay. I have them up for a good amount or best offer. So hopefully somebody gives me a good offer and these will head over to a new home. Here are all the strawberry shortcakes that Janine and I found for $6 between the two of us. How amazing. We did confirm that these are like the original strawberry shortcakes from I believe 1979. We even have the original strawberry shortcake herself right here. The condition is okay. Um, the clothes are a little bit stained, discolored a bit, but I mean, for $6, how amazing to have found vintage strawberry shortcake. I mean, we got tons of different characters, blueberry muffin. I believe one of these is um, like raspberry tart, I want to say, lemon meringue. Janine and I are going to have to decide what we want to do with them, um, but most likely we will lot them up all as a lot and put them up on eBay for somebody to rehome. They are just so cute and we were so, so excited to find this at the thrift store. I think this is like our first strawberry shortcake doll find out in the wild, so very exciting. It definitely is. So I got batteries in him. He was a bit corroded. I cleaned off the connections and he was a bit loud. He is a bit loud. It's so loud. But he works. Hey! And that's the the greatest part of it. Whoa. Oh my. Mm -mm. Okay, really, really loud. <laughs> but I didn't realize that these two things were lights, and the lights come up, and they... He's having uh, a rave. I mean, it's really cool. It's a really cool thing. He sells for, like, 30-plus shipping, which is really cool as well. Um, yeah. Got him for six, right? Yeah, I'm happy he works. Good find. Thanks. This pail was 99 cents, which was a good buy. It's this bright pink... Pail. Look at that. Laura pink. was right. It's a what, Laura? It's a general foam. It's probably general from the foam. early 2000s. Early 2000s. It still has that like thick, thick plastic. Mm -hmm. So definitely not like a new pail. New pails, their their faces aren't as indented. Mm -hmm. Like the eyes and the mouth doesn't have as much uh, texture. It's not as pails not as thick. So it's something to, I guess, put in your put in your book. Put in your little... Put in your pumpkin book. Your pumpkin notebook? Pumpkin... Yeah, pumpkin finder. <laughs> Put in your pumpkin finder. Um, so I was excited to get this. It's like, you know, it's like... It feels like the first of the Halloween season. I've got a pail, and I'm ready to go on pumpkin patrol. So... We had fun, didn't we, Laura? We did. It was fun. We saw a lot of different things today, and those vintage strawberry shortcakes really... Those are really cool vibes. Were really exciting. Yeah. So, um, actually, what? keep an eye out next week. There might be a, a fun and interesting something coming out. An update? An update. A surprise? A surprise. I don't know. But uh, keep a eye out for something, right? I, I think so. I think so, too. But uh, thanks for watching, everyone. See you next, See you time. next time. Bye. Bye.